morning, good morning guys. It's a little bit after 5 a.m. here in Bajawa. Shane and I woke up pretty early trying to catch sunrise. So we're here at this point called Watunari Wubu. It's about a 20 minute hike up from the parking lot. We're about halfway there. There's pretty stunning views of the volcano here. We're hoping the clouds clear and we get a good sunrise. Got a pretty thin ridge line here. Do not want to fall down there, yeah? <laughs> Actually looks like there's this crazy point over here. So we're gonna go walk up to that thing. Up to the point we go. This is gonna be a good walk up. I'm feeling it. Oh baby. Oh baby. Oh he's leaving me. He's leaving me hanging. There it is. There it is. So the volcano behind me, its name is Mount Enerie. It's actually the tallest volcano on the island of Flores and stands at 2,245 meters. We're getting pretty lucky with this sunrise here. All these clouds on this side of the volcano are clearing out. You can kind of see the vapors shooting out. And right behind me, sun, Matahari, coming up, lighting the whole volcano. If you look behind me, right here where we're standing is this crazy jagged ridge line. They call it Bukit Avatar, if you guys have ever seen that movie. And you can see why, it's something straight out of a James Cameron film. So we're standing here over on this ridge line. Yeah. And this. <laughs> look at that. That's, that's our, our shadow. shadow right there. And there's a rainbow like halo around us. Double rainbow across Double the sky. <laughs> All right guys, well that was quite the sunrise. We're gonna head back towards Bajawa. Bajawa is the small city here located in Central Flores, but surrounded by some absolutely beautiful nature. So we're gonna drive around, explore the area. We're gonna go check out some hot springs and then you're definitely gonna wanna stick around because we're gonna go to another overlook for sunset, which is supposed to have some insane views of this volcano. <laughs> arrived here at the Mangoruda Hot Springs, making our way down now. Coming in the hot springs, and these girls working at the ticket booth, they want a photo with Rob and I, so they're following us down to the springs and uh, do a little photo shoot with them. So we misunderstood, they actually want a photo of Rob and I in in the pool, swimming around. So Rob's about to derobe here, give him a show. <laughs> give him a show. Give him a show? Give him a show? <laughs> yeah. We got him. I got him. Put on a show. Oh, that's what they want to see. Oh, look at him. Look at him putting on a show. This place is really nice. We were in that main spring over there, but there's also this one here. It's got like a green look to it, and then it goes over to this waterfall over here. I'll show you guys. And over here, you've got this. Waterfall, small one. And it's pumping hot water, so when you're next to it, it's like blowing hot air on you. I'm not sure about Rob, but these are probably some of the nicest, clearest natural springs I've ever been to. It's beautiful here, the temperature is just right. If you go down back there, there's a little bit of a cooler pool and stream. So this is really beautiful, good place to come hang out, relax. Had a nice time in the hot springs here. Look at Shane, man. It's <laughs> loving life. We're gonna get back on the bikes and we're gonna hit the next spot. Okay, guys, after the hot springs, we went and grabbed a quick lunch we're and the then. Cold springs. <laughs> yeah. What? Now we're in the cold springs. Now we're in the cold springs, yeah. <laughs> grabbed a quick lunch and then we hung out for a bit um, just to wait for the sun to go down a little bit and we came up here to Punchak Wolobobo. Punchak means the top or the point, and this has got a pretty good overlook of the entire surrounding area, so we're gonna go check that out. 
the driving around this area has been pretty crazy. It's just every which way you look, there's different volcanoes popping up. There's not many people that live in this area, so it's pretty much empty roads. But we're coming up on this volcano view now, and it looks pretty wild. <laughs> look at that thing. Look at it. Look at the clouds. Look at the sky, man. We are sitting above the clouds right now. There's all these little viewing platforms where people are taking photos. What's up, bro? What's up? <laughs> hello, guys. hello, hello. What's up, photo? Oh, here we go. We're going to start taking photos with the locals now. This is nuts. This, this is crazy. <laughs> this is crazy. Okay guys, well we hope you enjoyed the beautiful sights here around Bajawa and that's going to close out our video. But that's not going to close out our time here. There's another side of Bajawa that we haven't explored yet and that we haven't showed you and that's the cultural side. There's actually a few traditional villages that exist here. So in our next video, we're going to visit a few of those and hopefully have some pretty cool experiences. So if you want to see those videos, definitely hit that subscribe button and hit that like button to support us too and we'll see you in the next one.